What's up guys, Sam I'm back with another figure review. This is the last one that I needed that was shipped from GameStop and that is the brand new Funko Pop Batman Forever the Riddler. It says Pop Heroes. He's not a hero. But anyways, so we got the Riddler played by Jim Carrey from the Batman Forever film back in 1995, which I was super excited about when it first came out. Saw it in theaters. I like the movie. I like the movie. I don't think it's as bad as Batman and Robin, but I do like this movie a lot. And I like Jim Carrey's portrayal of the Riddler. Now, before we get into the, the video, um, I, I want to talk about the different variations of the Riddler that we can, that, you know, Funko can make. Because he wore some different suits in this movie. There was a lot of different outfits that he had and different hairstyles too, which I never understood. He had short, spiky hair. And then he had long hair. It was always weird. I was as a kid, I was always like, why is he? Why does he have long hair and then short hair? Um, but there is different outfits they can give us. Especially they can even give us that deformed look that he had at the end of the film. You guys remember that? Um, so this is him here with the the hat, and he has the the jacket and the pants that you know have the question marks all over them. Uh, we come to the side, you can see the, the artwork of the actual figure, and on the back we have Two Face, which I already reviewed. So that's it for the packaging. Let's take out the Riddler and see if this guy is a pickup or a pass okay so the riddler does come with a circular display base because you're gonna need it he does not oh he does stand well on his own okay i, I tried standing standing him a second ago there you go see he falls over um so he does come with the base looking at the outfit you can see the jacket look how great this looks the colors look great the question marks look awesome i love the shoes with the gold belt buckle look how great that is these look so cool and you got the peg hole at the bottom of the feet he has his question mark cane which actually has uh, electronics in it. This, what is this, like a soft rubber? Yeah, it's a soft rubber. But you can see the question mark, and then you have the mask with the black makeup around the eyes. I think that looks great. Love the pose that he's in. It does look like something Jim Carrey would do. And he has the red hair because his hair changes colors throughout the film too. This almost looks like glasses. Um, the hat is uh, very nicely done as well, and it's got the question mark in the front. And then there is the back there. I'll give you guys a close-up on the back of the outfit looks awesome I, again the colors on him look really really cool when you see this in person you'll see how great the outfit actually looks you can see the collar right up there too and then looks like he's got a little pocket i think right there in the top left um so you can actually plug in the base we'll put that in here and let's see here that way you can get the Riddler to stand perfectly on his own. So now we have the Riddler in the collection, right guys? So we have him and then we also now we have the Two-Face and then we have Batman, you know, from Fat Batman Forever. And he's got the, the Riddler, the little, uh, what do you call it? The riddle in his, in his hand. So now we just need Robin. We need a Robin figure. We, you know what? Someone mentioned in my in a video that we need Alfred. I totally forgot Alfred. We need Alfred as well. We definitely need an Alfred. Um, there's there's again there's different versions of Batman they can give us. I wouldn't mind seeing an Edward Nigma, a Harvey Dent, or even a Bruce Wayne, a uh, uh, Dick Grayson. There's so many pops that Funko can give us, and I'm hoping I'm hoping we'll get more from these because I am absolutely loving it. 2020, as far as Funko goes. They've been knocking it out of the park with the Batman stuff, the killer clowns from outer space, and a bunch of other uh, other pops that they've came out with this year. But, I mean, these and the killer clowns have been the best. These are absolutely fantastic pops. And, again, if you're a Batman fan or a fan of the old films, you're definitely going to need these guys in your collection. So let me know in the comments below. Is it a pickup? Is it a pass? Did you like Batman Forever? Let me know in the comments below. Thumbs up the video, subscribe if you guys haven't. We'll see you soon. Well.